We need to invest not just in the physical and human infrastructure of today. We need to invest in jobs in the industries of tomorrow. Three decades ago, and this always disturbs me, even just repeating it, three decades ago, the United States was number one in the world for a share of their GDP being invested in research and development. We're number one in the world. We're now number eight in the world. Number eight in the world. China was number, or, or excuse me, we're, China was number nine in the world. Now they're number two in the world. Folks, Democrats and Republicans agree. We can't afford to lose this race. They came together in the Senate and an Innovation and Competition Act that Dick was very much a part of to help us grow the industries that win the jobs of the future. We need to lay the foundation for the next generation of American jobs and American leadership in manufacturing and technology. We're going to invest in historic black colleges and universities under minority-serving institutions, because while these schools may not have the endowments or the labs needed to generate these jobs, these students are just as capable of learning about all the things that are going to provide the jobs of the future.